October 21st is a special day set to celebrate the beauty of Korea's traditional clothing, Hanbok. Ahead of the special anniversary, a fashion show was held at one of Seoul's famous palaces to promote Hanbok to the world. Lee ji was there and filed this report. With K-pop and the Korean wave gaining popularity across the world, Hanbok, traditional Korean clothing, has also been getting attention. Putting on hanbok and walking around Seoul's grand palaces has even become a must-do activity for foreign tourists visiting the country. And to be honest, I saw a lot of pictures here at the palaces with the hanbok on. So I was like, I have to do it. I really have to do it. So I decided to come today. And so my... But hanbok hasn't been known outside of Korea for that long. At one of the earliest foreign hanbok fashion shows held in Paris back in 1994, the costume was mistakenly introduced as a Korean kimono by the local press. And ever since, many hanbok designers have been working to globalize the traditional attire by collaborating with world-renowned fashion leaders and brands and designing trendy hanboks. Kim Yejin is one such hanbok designer and researcher. By combining fashion and tradition, she's been invited to international fashion shows to show off her hanbok designs. While preserving traditional hanbok elements like the color or the bottom line of the jacket sleeves, I add modern statements to my designs. And the results are more trendy and suitable for everyday life, so people seem to really like it. The government, too, has been making efforts to share the beauty of traditional Korean attire with the world and have designated October 21st as the Day of Hanbok. The day celebrates its 21st anniversary this year, and just like in previous years, a fashion show was held at Gyeongbokgung Palace in Seoul on Friday. Under strobe lights and with the palace as the backdrop, models show off the elegant fine lines of Hanbok designed by Han Eun hee and Lee Young-hae. Under the theme My Pride, My Hanbok, the different interpretations of the costume, from those focusing on the traditional qualities to those with fancy additions, show the audience Hanbok's fashion potential. I really, really like it because they actually show a traditional piece of Korea. And that's something actually what I wanted to see when I, while I was here. So I'm quite, I'm quite happy about it. With Hanbok gaining more attention around the world, this event hopes to make Hanbok one of the leading parts of Korean culture in the nation's tourism industry. Lee Ji-won, Arirang News.